Hi there, so in this video I'm going to show you different ways to export your notebook data to PDF. So first thing, I want you to open Wolfram and then create one notebook. And here we're going to create one simple list. Let's say one, two, then three and then four. Okay, shift enter, you have your list. Next thing I want you to do is, let's say create a simple pie chart. Give it your list, close square bracket, and then shift enter and you have your bar chart. Now I want to export this notebook data to PDF. So I'm going to check file menu, then save as this should open one dialog box here that points to my documents and Wolfram Mathematica folder hit here it will allow you to save with type notebook.nb you can also save with pdf document so let's say i'm going to save with the example as its name save okay and now it will be stored there go to that directory and you have your PDF ready okay double click on it and you have the output from that notebook as it's displayed here okay you get the idea of simple saving as can do this now we will see some other options that allows you to do this from within your notebook now here let's check out one command name export so export and square bracket within double quotes let's name it test one dot pdf close double quotes then comma then percentage so that it can take the previous all inputs and outputs into your PDF file and then export it now do the shift enter and it will show output as test one PDF now here in su suggestion bar you have open import open file directory and full path file name so click on it and it will show you that it is stored in C users, my name, then documents, and then test one PDF. Now let's go there. Okay, now let me scroll to the place. Okay, now let's go ahead and check this. And here you have your PDF file. So it is outputting your previous input which was just this pie chart. Okay, now if you want to input your list as well and previous all three then the best option would be to go through file menu and save as so that it can save all the previous commands from your notebook. If you just want to go with only one input or output within your notebook then you can use percentage sign okay so this was short demo on how to export your notebook data to pdf and also multiple methods to export your output into pdf format